what is happening guys what is going on I I, I kind of have a <laughs> I have a little setup here done on my thingamabob where I can uh, pretty much I have the my broken headset set on my protein shaker I'm not protein shaker my protein tub so it like sits there and I could, I could just about reach over it's kind of awkward but uh, it works so I so yeah <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna play the Stanley Parable. I heard some good stuff about this. I haven't watched any videos. I know Pudes is playing it, uh, but I'm gonna give it a go myself because it sounded awesome. And it, it was like it's like 20% off, so I was like, lol, I'll buy it. So here we go. Let's get started. I, w I was gonna do a face cam, but I was like, nah. You know what? I was like, fuck it. But uh, I can't, I'm, I, I'm actually really excited to get into this now. Ooh, I can't wait. Come on, load faster, please. Please, please. Load faster. Please load faster than that, please. Click skip. This is the story oh God. of a man named Stanley. Stanley worked for a company in a big building where he was employee number 427. Employee number 427's job was simple. He sat at his desk in room 427 and he pushed buttons on the keyboard. Orders came to him through a monitor on the desk, telling him what buttons to push how long to push them, and in the water. This is what employee 427 did every day of every month of every year. And although others might have considered it soul winning, Stanley relished every moment of the orders to him, as though he had been made exactly for this job. And Stanley was happy. Well. And then one day, something very peculiar happened. Something that would forever change Stanley. Something he would never quite forget. He had been at his desk for nearly an hour when he realized that not one single order had arrived on the monitor for him to follow. Oh, shit! No one had showed up to give him instructions, call a meeting, or even say hi. Never in all his years at the company had this happened. This complete isolation. Something was very clearly wrong. Shocked, frozen solid, Stanley found himself unable to move for the longest time. All right. But as he came to his wits and regained his senses, he got up from his desk and stepped out of his office. Yeah, come on, Stanley, get your shit together. What the hell? Whoa. All of his co-workers what? were gone. What? what could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. What? No matter oh. how hard Stanley looked, he couldn't find a trace of his co-workers. What? Right, so I'm, I'm checking everything out here just in case. Can I jump? No, I can't. I'm rapidly tapping spacebar here. Stanley went around touching every little thing in the office. <laughs> the <laughs> Nor did it advance the story in any way. Oh, that's good. I like that. Come on! Come on! Uh, clock! What time is it? It's currently, uh... I don't know what time it is actually. Open this door. I'm, I'm making sure I'm not gonna miss it. Oh, I keep keep closing the doors. And good in here. And good shit in here. Oh. Oh, damn it. Oh. There's a room in there. There's a room there. there. I can't get in. Fuck it. Oh. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Fuck you. I'm going on the right. This was not the correct way. What? He wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Can't jump. Well, I can't. I, f I figured that out quite that early. Right here we go. Let's see. Can I? Can I? Ah, wow. Yes, truly a room worth admiring. It had really been worth the detour after all, just to spend a few moments here in this immaculate, beautifully constructed room. Damn right. Stanley simply stood here, drinking it all in. Oh, that, oh yeah, I'm drink. Look, I'm, make, I'm clicking everything to make sure I'm not like something's not hidden or anything. But yeah, it doesn't look like there's anything in the damn room at all. But eager to get back to business, what? Stanley took the first open door on his left. First open door is on my left. Hmm. What the hell's in here? Now, do you know what? I'm gonna follow this one. I'm gonna see where this takes me. And so he detoured through the maintenance section. Walked straight ahead to the opposite door and got back on track. Fuck you! I'm gonna see what the hell's down here. Hmm? Can't stop me, bro. Can't stop me. So I heard there's like quite a quite a several uh, several different endings to this. 
Uh, there's like different alternatives depending on your. Fuck no. Damn right. So now in order to get back, he needed to go on. From here, it's um left. Any other door open? Hmm. Oh well, shit. Oh no. Ah, what? It's to the right man. God damn it. No, I dab dab that. Why would I have ever said it was to the right? Yeah. Was I think? I want to go to the right door. God damn it. Let me out. Okay, yes. I've got it. Right, come on. This story is absolutely definitely this way. Hmm. Gonna double check the doors. Huh? Make sure you're not bullshitting me, asshole. No. Uh, <clears throat> well shit looks like jet, so uh car. Can't go through the car. Let's go down here. Any good shit down here? Oh, Whoa! What? I can't jump. Let me out. What is this shit? You, I'm gonna wander off track. Oh god. Yeah, so I heard there's like a, quite a number of different endings depending on your decisions, which is pretty damn awesome. I want to do it uh, over a few times just to uh, uh, see you get the feel of it. But the, I, 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 shut up. I. Uh, fuck. Shut up. Alright, I am going to go to the lab door this time. You know, for the lulls. For the lulls. We're gonna, gonna listen to them. Whoa! What? what the fuck? No, no, I restarted. I swear, I definitely restarted the game over, completely fresh. Everything should be. Oh, did something change? Stanley. What the fuck did you do? Change anything when we were back in that room with yeah. the monitors? No, I did not. The story somewhere. Or... What? Hold on. Why am I asking you? Yeah, what the fuck? The story. It was right here just a minute ago. I know for sure, but it's here somewhere. Okay then. It's an adventure. Come, Stanley. Let's find the story. Hmm. All right. Wow. Um. Whoa. <coughs> oh God. Uh. I'm gonna go into this one. Let's go down here. Oh, I'm intrigued to see the one behind the chairs. What the hell's in here? Oh my God. This is so confusing. Whoa! Hold on. I'm back to where I was. Oh, hold on. Hold on. I'll say hold the phone. This is the worst adventure I've ever been on. I can hold the phone. You, there definitely was a story here before. Do we just do we need to restart the game again? Yeah. Well, kind of unlikely that we'll ever progress by starting over and over again. But it's got to be better than this. Okay, let's give it a shot. Why not? Oh, hold on. Ah! Oh, I look like. Oh, here we go. Are, are we definitely restarting the same? Oh my God. Right, let's do this shit. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Did not miss any memo. I'm going to fuck shit up. Oh, GG. I might be remembering this wrong. It's possible the story is back where we just came from. Why don't we go back the other direction? God. Let me out. Let me out. See, there's a broom in there. There's a fucking... Damn. Damn it. Whoa. Is that me? Yeah, it is. All right. Thought he closed the door on me. Oh. Can I go in here? Oh, I cannot. Hmm. Janitor, is there a closet? What? Aha. I knew we'd miss What? The story. What the fuck? No, Whoa, what the... Yeah, fuck you with me now. Okay, let's head back the other way and retrace our steps. This asshole's fucking with me now. Come on. We get what? Ah. Oh. Oh. Come on. Now this 
Well, I'll be honest. I don't recognize this place at all. No, they do. Is this the story? I don't think so. I can't quite recall, but I believe my story took place in an office building. Yeah, what the hell? Is that correct? Yeah. Um, you fucked shit up. Remember, Stanley? Well, do you know what? Since I've completely forgotten what we were supposed to be doing, how about this? Uh, you yeah! Congratulations! <laughs> I know you put in a lot of hard work. Da damn straight. Really paid off, so good job. Oh no. I don't feel right about this at all. We both know you didn't put in any actual work. For I did! Time. Fuck you! Some people win fair and square, and this was not one of those situations. Okay. I'm getting weirded out by whatever this place is. I don't care what I like it. this time, I have to restart. No, fuck you, I like this. Ah, No fun. Right, come on, we can, we can still do this one. Whoa, right. All right, I've got a solution. This time, to make sure we don't get lost, I've employed the help of the Stanley Parable Adventure Line. Just follow the line. How simple is that? Hmm. Ah. Huh. Fuck you! Come on. Fuck this guy. No. Oh. Hmm. You know what? I'm. We. I might actually follow the line. Cause. Yeah. Fuck it. I'll follow the line. Check the doors. And they get check. The line knows where the story is. <laughs> it's over in this direction. Onward, Stanley, to destiny. But here's a thought. What? Wouldn't wherever we end up be our destination, even if there's no story there? Or to put it another way, is the story of no destination still a story? Simply by the act of moving forward, are we implying a journey such that a destination is inevitably conjured into being by the very manifestation of the nature of life itself? Okay, Stanley, I need to follow this train of thought for a minute. Just stick with me. Now, we can both agree that the nature of existence is, in fact, a byproduct of one subjective experience of that existence, right? Okay. Now, if my experience of your existence rests inside of your subjective experience of this office, is this office, in fact, the skeleton of my own relative experiential mental subjective construct? Whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on. I thought it'd be weird back there. Well, I what? I not sure where I was going with all that. You know what? I think what we need right now is a bit of music to lighten the mood. Music? Really? That, that, that is not lightning mood whatsoever. Okay, now music is what? Good shit here. That's music. What the hell? That's just a, what the fuck is going on here? I should have went the other way. Well, I can't. It did me a full circle. What the fuck's down here? Any good shit in here? Where the hell is this taking me? Oh my god. No, fuck you. I'm not going there. Oh my god. Where is this taking me? Wait, cut the music. Yeah. Go back oh my god. Fuck you, I'm not looking at any fur. Oh, it's right here. We're back at the office. What the No, no, no. Line, you do know we're looking for the Stanley Parable, right? The story? Is any of this ringing a bell? What the f What Oh, that's so confusing. Right, I'm gonna take a left. Oh my, I'm so lost. We're back in the office again. Alright, hold on. Hold on here now. What if I go this way? Yeah, I'm gonna go backwards. How about that? Yeah. Stanley, this fern will be very important later in the story. What? Is it? Make sure you study it closely and remember it carefully. This fern? That's a fern, is it? No. I'm so lost and confused. Alright, so we can't go back. Alright, so I'm guessing we have to go this way. Okay! Alright. Fuck you! Oh, I can't go that way. Alright, let's see. Let's go this way. 
Aha! The place where no line. Oh my god. This is the door uh, I was gonna go in the first time. Still missing the doors. Did we make a mistake following the line? Perhaps we could have found the story on our own. Well, fuck. Come on. So, d d does he want me to follow the line or what? Where is this taking me now? Ooh. Oh, we're back oh, here again. No, 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 not again. Line, how could you have done this to us? And after oh. we trusted you, after everything we've been through, you... Oh, I can't take this anymore to hell with it. Restart. Oh, I, what? 